let her accept the truth. I know what Governor Shawulu did was very, very wrong. But let's be she said herself. Let me tell you guys the truth. But most of our senior officers, they are very, very wicked. They are even worse than Governor Shawulu. Let me not lie to you. So let me tell you one story. Before I will tell you this story, I know definitely they will come for me. They will lock me up and they will dismiss me. I don't care. I can't even endure again. Before coming out to make this video, I can't endure again. I can't. So, I don't want to die young. Definitely, I know they will come for me. But before anybody will dismiss me, this me, anyone that call for the other, anybody that call me for any other, anybody that want to do my child, anybody that want to do my other to dismiss me, they will, the person that do the other will not see peace. He or she will not see peace. And if anything should happen to me, please hold on I be a bukarin responsible for the GS Ogo and bigger than that I be Abdul Karim and I be Shilibo who these three people responsible they are due they they, they 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 don't want me to grow they don't want my progress this will happen 2022 I was supposed to come to me medical center or job we are made for I be Abdul Karim who request sex for me and I refused Ever since then, this must be my nightmare in the army. He threatened to dismiss me each time he see me. He injects me, come to my room to inject me. My own apartment, come to my room here to inject me. Send some boys to my house. If I'm lying, I have all evidence. I have evidence against him. And I have witnesses. Come to my house to inject me. He also stigmatized me that I have meta in his each time I try to expose him. Or each time any senior person, any senior, uh, any senior officer trying to intervene, he will tell them that I have meta in this. He even wrote to DOA to abort to board me out. He wrote to DOA three good times to board me out of army. He freeze my account for one year. If it's my account February last 18 date, no salary. I've tried to comp I've tried to comp I tried I cried to some senior officers. I I wrote a petition using section 179 of the Enforces Act. I've I've done so many, I've seen so many officers, senior officers, junior officers to intervene, but none of them is giving me listen here. But and anyone who's trying to intervene, you tell them I have mental illness. The day he locked me, he injected me, he almost raped me. When they caught him and he said, I have meta in this, he took me to psychiatry hospital. He went to lock me up there. He locked me up there for one good month without any medication. He denied me access to military courses. And meanwhile, you know, in, in, they know very well that my progression in the army determined my course attendance. No course. Now they've given me admission in medical school. They refuse to release me. I would. I, there, was, there was a time I called my dad. My dad interview was telling my dad to. He was telling my dad to tell me to obey the last order. What was the last order for him to sleep with me? Deny me everything. I can't even go on pass to see my 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 parents. No pass. No leave for me. No leave. But please and please if any shit will happen to me, please hold them responsible. Hold Kone Ibia Bukari responsible, especially Kone Ibia Bukari. Kone GS Ogo. Bigger than the IB Shelebo. Hold them responsible. They are my nightmare in the army. They've done everything to tarnish my image because they are they are all cosmate. I don't know why army will promote such wicked and heartless people. I don't know what I've done to them. I don't know. I don't know what I did. Today I haven't, I haven't collected salary. I can't even endure this again. I can't endure it. Let the worst happen. Let the worst happen. I don't bloody care.
the way going up and tarnishing tarnishing my image I can't go on pass i can't go on leave i can't do anything in the army telling the army to board me out of army they set it they did nobody set a board before before they will board any soldier and there will be a boy no boy they just sent to amy to board me out sent to amy to freeze my account with no no just reason i've seen most soldiers with one leg with no with no leg at all with no eyes but they are still in the service but they decide to board me out because they don't want me to expose them please and please if anything should happen to me please hold on it i'll be abducarum responsible hold him responsible is my problem in the army but i don't care if anybody wants to dismiss me let them do their worst i don't bloody care so my dad kept on you know trying to intervene and you know but people tell me my dad to tell me to obey the last order okay i see that was not enough each time you feel like you want to embarrass me you ask some some soldiers to beat me up wasn't to beat me up i start beating me up you inject me to ask a master one officer funke ayen she's a female a soldier she will ask her to set me up she will set me up you inject me and they go and throw me inside somewhere at the end of the day this bigger general i be shilipo and some of those senior corny they will come to they are not promoted to bigger general they will come to that place and they will be videoing me they will be videoing me so countless times like that so early this year i wrote early so early last year i wrote a new dress i went to military police i went to legal service they were using power i could not see i could not do anything because all my effort were all, always wasted because they, they are more if they have influence they have power and they are supporting so nobody want to listen to many today tell the senior people that's what they will believe so i went there i wrote and at the end of the day when they said they set a boy after the, the board of inquiry at the end of the day the call were the medical call were biased because they are the most senior officer in medical call they were biased so i don't know why nigeria will promote why why am will promote such bad people so 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 bad leaders i don't know why i will promote them so they deny me so many things so many things i'm not the only person no but me i can't endure again because i'm not even progressing as if i'm not even i'm not even in the job connect on your or go each time any senior officer trying to interview you will send the border letter to them meanwhile Ami Ekota have refused to say to approve the border letter because they said the border letter I don't even know how the how the 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 composite nobody called me for any BOI nobody called me for any interview now only Jesus Christ now I never see one on one and I've been praying to him for endurance but I've, I think I've endured enough for one good year without salary no cost no pass no leave nothing nothing just the work kawaii i've endured i can't endure again let the worst happen the worst is to dismiss me and even person that dismiss they better pass me like this because i don't feel endure again i'll be keeping keep, keep, keep it quiet because of my dad because of my family my, my my parents but i can't endure again obviously this work not before me so each time anybody trying to interview they will tell the person i have mental illness they'll continue to give me that injection they have do you want me to be happy when you are not paying me my salary how do you want me to happy when my mates are going on because you my junior that meet me in the army going on because i'm no as in no progression i'm not even growing what do i do i don't have anything to do again i've done the normal procedure i followed the normal procedure the normal book i mean the everything they asked me to do i've done it but nothing nothing good is coming out now only god i know i never i never talk i never see i'm talking to god i mean to say now, only god i never seen i've spoken to some senior people who pretend as if they they they, they are hearing me meanwhile they don't even care about anybody they don't care about me please tell me to share me and share this video to human rights to anybody that, would, that, would, that, that can help me to intervene 
Chris Hepney. Peace.